Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use AI Curvature node in Maya's Arnold. First of all, let me have a cube and a simple light for the scene. And let's apply a new AI standard surface shader. Like that. And if we go to the hyper shade and see the graph network of this shader and hit tab you can simply write AI curvature to create this node now let me just um, connect this to base color temporarily so we can see what's, what it's doing and basically what this node does is it kind of detects the edge and applies some color on it and there are several parameters that you can adjust um, okay there's nothing that much to do for now but you can change the radius if you want um, I'm gonna apply this node to some more complex mesh maybe you need to adjust the dress hold but for now it's just fine so um, let me show you how to make it for um, some kind of old paint effect um, so first of all I'm going to connect this to specular specular roughness but before I do that let me just um, apply some uh, clear color on this mesh and uh, we can um, have a fractal texture for a more jagged edge so it looks like uh, damaged or something Anyways, um, now I'm gonna combine it by using layer texture. We can just drag it, drag and drop this thing by using middle mouse click. And before we do, we can go to fractal mode and check on alpha's luminance. And same in the layer texture. Let me just connect it to the base color. So it's not working. So let's change the black mode to multiply. So now we kind of see. And you can also Just some parameters in fractal texture as well. Um, let me increase or decrease the frequency ratio and level max to make it a little more crisp. Yeah, I think this is going to work just fine. Yeah, something like that. So now what we can do is we can uh, connect the alpha, connect from alt alpha to specular roughness. Or you can even apply this to the metalness and we can also use it for the, co the base color of this um, standard surface
to do so, we can create a RAM node for the actual base color. For example, we can just remove the black and apply some red color for this RAM node. And again, I'm going to use layer texture and drag this thing, this two and um, take a look at this again it's not working again so we should change the blend mode to add so now it's working This thing should be reversed. Just connect alpha to the input X and output to all speckle roughness. If we do that, Sense right. The edges um, fully full of reflection, and the actual area that's painted is not that glossy. So Do this to the mountainous. Let me just try that. Back to the eye curvature. And increase the radius, and you can even increase the multiply value. Um, looks pretty bad because I'm using this simple cube for the actual result but if you use more complex mesh it's gonna work better I guess um, anyways this is uh, one way you can use this node and I think it's really quick and useful so you don't have to paint it by hand. Anyway, that's it for this tutorial. And please subscribe to my channel for more like this in the future. And thank you for watching.